high density patch decks and splice decks easily mount into the fiber distribution system. Each deck includes front and rear cable management guides and a cable clamp kit. When installing decks, select the target rack unit location. We recommend starting from the bottom up for easier installation. Thread the provided 1224 screws three to four turns in the bottom screw holes. Place the deck over the screws. While supporting it with one hand, insert the top screws and tighten all screws to hand tight torque. Facing the front of the mounted deck, place the screws in the hold tabs and install the front cable management louver over the deck screws on the left side and attach with the hand tool. Facing the rear of the mounted deck, place the rear routing guide in the target deck mounting tabs and insert the setting screw. To install the trunk cable clamp kit, place the clamp into the receiving slots adjacent to the target deck in either the down or up orientation. Slide the clamp kit towards the deck until the spring pin engages the hole. If you've installed a splice deck, splice deck trays are removed from the rear side of the frame. Start by removing the label window from each splice deck tray by applying slight pressure from the side of the window. Then, starting from the top of the deck, remove the three trays rearward from the prospective deck guide slots. You're now ready to install molded splice trays in the splice deck as needed to achieve the desired frame configuration. When complete with the tray, slide each tray forward in its deck guide slot until the label window mounting tabs are accessible reinstall each label window and return the tray to the closed position. When installing cassettes or adapter plates into patch decks, simply slide the patch tray forward to the stop point, lift the label window, and insert the cassette or plate. When removing, press down on the release button and slide the cassette or adapter plate forward. To make connections to HDX adapter plates, we recommend accessing them from the rear side of the frame. You can also remove patch trays by depressing the release lever located on the left side of each tray. Remember, each tray has a stop point at the fully opened and closed positions. Slide the tray to the stop point and engage the release lever to move the tray into place. Forcing a tray past these points may damage the deck and the locking tabs. Label strips come with each patch deck and splice deck. These are inserted in the magnification holders from the top. Custom laser printed labels can be created with professional labeling tools, such as Rhino 6000 and 6500 series label makers. Leviton offers a template for creating labels in Microsoft Excel.